why happiness makes you move and movement makes you happy. Again, we can understand this by talking about the limbic system, which is our emotional system. And right next to the system, it's very, very connected, very close within the brain. I'm just drawing very simplified here. There's another system which is called the basal ganglia. Name doesn't really matter, but this is also very much responsible for movement, also for habit, for a lot of things, but it is very much involved if you move, right? And it makes sense if you move and the system is active, since the emotional system is very close and is very connected. So if you move a lot, this area is active, so this area will also get active. So by doing sports, your mood is, getting, is, is going to be lifted up. But on the other way, if you're happy, Look at the people in the stadium. If they're happy and excited, they move. If somebody shoots a goal, it's like, yeah, they move around because they're happy and they can't inhibit themselves and they have to move because those systems are so close. And you can also use this for yourself again the other way around. They did studies with depressed people. They just looked in the mirror for 10, 15 minutes in the morning and they just um, smiled and used those muscles, which is again also affecting your emotional system. Of course, here there are also other factors involved such as the mirror neurons here in the prefrontal cortex because you see yourself smiling which then also just gives you good mood. There are a lot of things and again I'm just trying to simplify things here but since the movement system and the emotional system is connected so well there is some connection here. The mind yeah, body connection you can call this. Another study I think they did this at Harvard also um, if you do some alpha poses such as standing like this or like this you release I think even 20% more testosterone. And that's why they say if you want to give a speech in front of a lot of people and you're excited, go to the toilet, stand like this, it gives you more confidence. And then actually, again, this, um, yeah, it's connected then to how you actually present because you feel more confident, you make less mistakes, you're less, less afraid.